In this video, we'll factor the equation x squared minus x minus 30 equals 0. And we'll use these rules here to help us. The first thing we want to do when we factor this equation is set up a skeleton equation. That'll look like this. Next, we'll add the signs in. If I look at this equation up here, I have a negative here and here. So if I have both terms negative, I'll use this format right here. I'll have a plus and then a minus. Once I do that, I can find the factors for the last term, and they should add up to equal the middle term. So we're looking for the factors of the 30 here. We could have 30 times 1, 15 times 2, or 6 times 5. And I want them to add up to this negative 1x here. So it looks like 6 and 5. If I had a negative 6 and a positive 5, that would give me that negative 1. So I'll put a negative 6 and a positive 5. And these should be the correct numbers for x squared minus x minus 30. Let's check that, though. We can use the FOIL method. We could have the first term. That's the x times x. That's x squared. x times minus 6. That's minus 6x. Inside terms, 5 times x, so plus 5x. And then 5 times minus 6, that's minus 30. That equals 0. If we look at this middle term here, minus 6x plus 5x, that's minus x. So this matches what we have up here. So that's correct. Now we should find the roots from this for this whole equation. We do that by setting x plus 5 to 0, and then we solve for x. So we add a negative 5 to each side. x is going to equal minus 5. Over here, x minus 6 equals 0. Add 6 to both sides, x equals 6. So these are the solutions for this equation. If we put a minus 5 in for x here, this will all add up to 0. Likewise, we could also put a positive 6 in for x and then figure out what it's equal to, and it's going to equal 0 as well. So both of these are solutions to this equation. This is Dr. B factoring the equation x squared minus x minus 30 equals 0. Thanks for watching.